Hi everyone, I hope you're all having a good week. It's the latest episode of the Citizens Network Weekly Roundup video. Now, if you remember in last week's video, I did say that in place of this weekly roundup, I will be doing a quick introduction and tour to Trello. So I will warn you, this video will be slightly longer than usual. Um, but I have put the link for the Citizens Network Trello board in with the description of this video. So without further ado, let's get into it and get started with Trello. So if you click on the link that I provided within the description of this week's weekly roundup video, you will come to a screen looking like this. Now, obviously, it says log into Trello, and that is because I already have a Trello account. But if you haven't already got one, all you need to do is scroll right down to the bottom where it says sign up for an account. Click on that, and it will take you to a new screen saying sign up for your account. All you need to do here is put your email address in and add a password. Or alternatively, you can use your Google account, Microsoft account, or even your Apple ID. And just to let you know, this is completely free, so it will not cost you anything to have an account with Trello. So once you have signed up for your free account on Trello, this is what your workspace will look like once you've logged into it. Now, for you guys, seeing as you have clicked on the link to join the Citizens Network community log, all you need to do is scroll down right to the bottom um, where it says guest workspaces. And that is where the Citizens Network community log will show up for you. All you need to do is click on that community log which will take you through to here. Now, as you can see, there's different cards such as proposed discussion topics for the next meeting. I've even done a key for areas and we've also done different cards on different issues such as public transport, housing, facilities, open spaces, care, employment and education, health and fitness and examples of good practice. Now, if there's anything that you feel that needs to be added as a topic that isn't already, you can do that, which I will show you later within this video. Now, if you have an issue, for example, surrounding accessibility with something like public transport, all you need to do is press add to card and create a title for that. So as an example, you could say um, temporary bus stops. All you need to do once you've done that title is add the card. Then if you click on it again and go into open card here, you can actually then create a description and let us know a bit more about the issue that you are facing surrounding accessibility with temporary bus stops and continu continuously changing. So in the description, you could put something like, I don't know, um, roadworks makes bus stops change all the time. The time without warning. Now, me being autistic, if I was in that position, that would fluster me quite a lot because I like to have things planned to an absolute T. So if the bus stop changed suddenly and I wasn't aware of it, that would stress me out. So you can also put how that affects you. So being autistic, means it causes a lot of stress can't spell today with a sudden changes perfect so that's all done and all you need to do is press save which will then 
save your description of that issue that you are facing. Now, as you can see on the right hand side of this card, you can see all different things such as join, members, labels, checklists, dates, attachments and cover. Now, in the dates bit, which I would recommend, you can add when you have done that. So, today is Thursday the... Oh, bear with me a second. Today is Thursday the 18th. Um, and then that can add the start date so that that will allow us to see when that has been created as a card. Also as well, if you are struggling and you are noticing this issue in a certain area, all you need to do is press labels, which will then take us through to this bit. So as you saw on the key bit, green is Birmingham. So you can add that and then come out which as you can see then we'll save it. So you, we know from the card that you have just added about temporary bus stops that it's in the Birmingham area and if we log into it, we can see that roadworks make bus stop ch change all the time without any warning and being autistic means it causes a lot of stress with sudden changes. So we can see that and this is something that I then can pass on to the citizens network panel so that they can analyze that and look at how things can be improved now just quickly if you have got something that a topic that we have not put within this board what you would like to add all you need to do is put the title so as an example um going out maybe going out whether that's leisure you can add that card and then what i usually do is just put going out again so then you can actually add a cover which is a photo so what i usually have done with all of these images is just literally copy and paste an image off google but as an example i'll just click on this one Bear with me. Now one thing I have actually forgotten to mention, which I quickly will show you now, is you may have noticed in here that you can also add comments. So if you saw a card that someone else had created as an example, and you can actually really resonate with that because that's also a problem for you, you can actually add a comment You can, and even tag people in similar to how they would with Facebook as an example. So I'll just quickly add Alex into here um, and say, this is an issue and press save so alex will be notified with that comment now also as you can see i have also added another label so just to make you aware with the key you can add it for multiple areas so i've also put warsaw as an example and all you need to do is click onto it and you can also take them away so I'll just quickly show you again, it's selected for Birmingham as an area so far, but if you're also notice, noticing that issue in Warsaw as well, you can click red, which will let you add that. So yeah, and then as you can also see, you can also see there in the right hand corner that there is also one comment. Similarly, it has that for entry into parks, and also it has eight comments for gym prices not affordable now if you have something as an issue or concern surrounding accessibility that does not fit in line with any of the lists that we have created already for you then 
that's not a problem because you can add another list yourself. So all you need to do is click add another list and enter a title. So let's just say leisure as an example and press add list. And one thing that I would recommend is that you just type leisure in again and I'll show you why in a second. Press add card and click onto that. And as you can see where it says cover, you actually can put an image similar to how I have done it with all the other lists. Now, the thing that I have done is generally found an image off of Google and literally just copied and pasted it here. So once you've done that, it will automatically save, but I'll let you guys have a go at that so that you can have a play with it yourself. So yeah, that is Trello. And if you've got any other questions or anything, please let me know. You can email me at ashley.jones at midlandmencap.org.uk or you can call me on 07912 269035 and I'll be happy to help. And one thing as well that I'd really like to point out to you guys is if there's a problem, please don't worry. If you've done something wrong, please don't worry because it's really easily rectified. Um, this platform is really easy to use. So as I say, if you've done something wrong, don't worry, just let me know and we can sort it out. So yeah, I hope this has been informative for you. But as I say, if you have any questions, please get in touch and let me know. And I hope to see all of your issues and concerns logged with Trello. And um, just make sure as well, if you have any examples of good practice, make sure you put it in there because I think it's really good to show examples of what is good um, and what experiences you have had that are great as well. So make sure that you do use that as well.